Hi guys, Dave Denise here and welcome to this new video. Today I am going to Oasis Wildlife in Fuerteventura. This morning I took the ferry from Lanzarote to Ventura and took the bus for a two hour drive and now I am here at the zoo. So let's get some tickets and go inside. So far I really like how the zoo is looking. It's very natural, like there are trees everywhere. And I really do like that a lot of waterfalls. So that's a really cool vibe. However, I am somewhat confused with uh, the way how you can walk in this park like I thought I could walk here but apparently I cannot so I have to find my way to the right animals because I'm lost now in my other zoo video there were some crocodiles but I didn't film them and Aaron was very sad about that so this time I will film some crocodiles for him there it is oh no that's just a normal log haha <laughs> funny I must say though I don't think I've ever seen this many small crocodiles together there's so many of them. Look! It's right over there, it's so cute! It looks so fluffy. Well, exactly this. <laughs> Buy me one. It looks so cute. <laughs> I love these drawings. <laughs> so this is actually quite informative. Pause if you want to read. I really like it. It's something uh, I didn't know before, so that's really cool. Think about wearing some closed shoes and comfortable clothes because as you can see here it's like very muddy road and you're just walking around on paths like these. They have a lot of monkeys here and I also see some camels right there in the back. Oh, see how close they get. Apparently you can feed them and here's a piece of carrot. Let's see. <laughs> That's very funny. So you can feed the camels here if you have like a bag with food that you can buy. I think at the beginning where you also buy the tickets. Um, and for me, it's kind of the same as with the horse. My mom has horses, so I kind of know what to do. Like just keep your hand flat, right? And the carrot on top and then just they just like snatch it from your hand. I think the sea lion show just started like a couple of minutes ago. So let me see if I can go there and if we can still see it. I just finished with the sea lion show and I think this is some kind of reptile cave so let's go and see what's inside yes I was correct reptiles this is very cool done though they just have like normal tree roots and plants coming through the cave here as well a whole opening for the plants I really love that they do this because it means that they actually care about the trees that grow here and they build everything around it instead of just breaking everything down and putting their stuff there. They also have a lot of toilets. I really like that. Even more crocodiles. Wow. Erin is gonna be so happy about this. I'm still figuring out where exactly I'm going and I believe I'm walking now towards the fauna life and the birds life shows so we'll see what that is all right i found the place for the fauna life and it will start in about 20 minutes so let's see if we can do something until the show starts look these turtles are just chilling just eating their salad they're not trying to kill us this is actually like so scary oh my god <laughs> they have even more crocodiles over here Aaron, i think this is the perfect zoo for you lots of crocodiles so this tree right here is supposedly a triangle palm, but to me it doesn't look like a triangle. I also saw a palm and it's called date palm. Do you think that it's a palm tree that can find your one true love and set you up on a date together? Because that would be very cool. Here we have a queen palm. Well, um, where is your crown? Doesn't really look like a queen to me. She's not wearing a crown. Nor am I at the moment, but mine is at home. Why is there a random rooster walking around? Excuse me, sir, what are you doing here? Oh, no time to talk? 
Are you following me? I thought you didn't have time to talk. Yeah, yeah, pretend like you don't know what I'm talking about. This morning when I came here with the ferry, it was cold. It was literally cold. Of course, it was like 7 in the morning, but it was very cold. Now it's almost 12 and it's getting really hot. The sun is really, really hot. So I think it's time for an outfit change. Let's see if I can find a toilet. Time for outfit change. Just finished the Fauna live show and it was so cool. First they showed us a couple of reptiles like turtles, iguanas and snakes. And after that they gave us a little bird show and it was so funny they let the birds fly with the reptiles. They came like literally in front of you and they also put some of the birds on people's heads. It was really funny and really cool. And right now I'm walking in a botanic garden I believe. I see a lot of cactuses or cacti, still don't know which one is correct, but I see a lot of them. <laughs> I'm going to walk through here and then I'm going to the bird show. And since we already saw some birds uh, like parrots during the fauna life, I think this is like birds of prey kind of show. Uh, if you watch the other zoo video from Lanzarote, you know what I'm about to say. And in this birds of prey show, I really hope that we don't get hit with wings. And with we, I mean me, because this time I'm on my own. Tuve is not here to get the hit instead of me. <laughs> it fucking hit me! <laughs> Let's hope they are careful and they fly over my head instead of against it. Ooh, I have to climb a whole mountain here to get up. With the wind now, you feel the wind here. I'm completely out of breath. This is what I'm talking about. We're walking up here now. You can see here how high we are. The mountains, you can see the ocean right there. Oh, let's see where this is going. Everybody is going that way. But I see this and I'm curious to see where it's going. It's a dead end. What do we have here? Another secret path, a narrow path. Let's see where this is going. I feel like an explorer. I'm going on adventure. No trespassing, well, I don't want to. It looks like if I would go down there, I would fall and get injured. So let's follow the arrows. <laughs> so many cacti. And my arms are without clothes, so I'm really scared to get stung by them. I don't want that. Bird's life, that's where we want to go, so this way. Up the mountain! Yes! We made it all the way up the mountain. Whew, I'm completely out of breath by this walk. We got a bird on the loose. <laughs> Alright, that's one. <laughs> I don't know if this is on purpose or by accident that the birds are flying high in the sky, but if it is on purpose, it's kind of cool that they have a little bit of freedom soaring around before doing a show.
the bird show just finished. It was indeed a birds of prey show. And earlier I was talking about not getting hit by a bird and obviously it was kind of a joke uh, considering what happened in Lazarotti. But of course I did get picked out for something and I needed to put my arms up like this and it would like fly straight between over my head and then I needed to make a circle with my hands and it needed to fly like through the circle and I was so scared it was gonna hit my face because it was going solo over the floor and then all the way up over my head and I was like please don't hit me please don't hit me please don't hit me if I'm correct there's kind of a train inside the park and right now I am waiting at a train stop um, so the train should come here soon and then they, the train can bring us like to the next point which is the elephants. I'm talking about it and it appears. There it is. That's a very interesting train. It's my camel friends. Only different ones, not the ones from this morning. <laughs> Hello. Oh my god, I see a giraffe. I want to take a picture with a giraffe. Oh my gosh, look how close they are. Making a selfie with a giraffe is still quite a big challenge, uh, especially since I don't have a bag of food for them, which you, by the way, can buy here. You cannot bring your own food, but it's just 150, and then you get a bag with like fruits or grass or whatever, and you can give it to the camels and uh, giraffes. Uh, but I didn't buy one, so obviously it was difficult to take a picture because they were just looking at me and they were like, "You don't have any food. I'm not coming to you." <laughs> so, but I did my best. You want to take a selfie with me? You don't? Why? <laughs> As you saw, taking a picture with a camel is much easier, so that you can do. It sounds like I'm hearing under the sea from the little mermaid in the background. I was correct, indeed, it's under the sea from the little mermaid. I don't know where they're playing it, I think in the restaurant. Very funny, but they have good music taste in the zoo anyway because during the show I heard uh, Disney songs like Pocahontas, Colors of the Wind I heard Never Enough from The Greatest Showman I heard Rio from the Rio movie, like the carnival song um, What else? Jurassic Theme Park was very very funny during the reptile show So very good music taste, I like it I basically already finished the whole zoo. I went everywhere and the bus will come in about two hours. So I've decided to go again to the sea lion show since I missed the beginning the first time. So now I want to see it from the start. And afterwards, I'll see how much time I have. Maybe I'll walk around a little bit or visit an animal that I like and then we go back to the bus. I'm going to walk towards the entrance again. I do want to go to the souvenir shop because I want to see if they have a keychain, maybe with the Fuerteventura and the zoo's name on it. That would be fun. And then back to the bus. I am now in the shop and it's pretty big actually. A lot of stuffed animals and a lot of things. I don't think I've ever seen this kind of fish as a toy, as a stuffed animal. I bought this keychain because it has lions and I love lions, they are my favorite animals. And also it says Oasis Wildlife, which is the zoo, and Fuerteventura, which is the island. I'm going back to the bus now. This was my day here at Oasis Wildlife Zoo on Fuerteventura. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to give a big thumbs up, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and hit the bell so you always get a notification when I post something new. And I'll see you guys in the next video.